Welcome to the video tutorial showing you how to use an iPod or iPhone to control your home. First, let's have a look at some of the screens. The dim setting can be fully controlled from your iPod. You can control more than just lights. We have support for amplifiers, projectors, TV and more. Simply come to the website to download your profiles. Not only can we control devices, but we can also show information like weather. Here you can see the information for Honolulu. Security systems are integrated as well. So that is all great, but how can you do it for yourself? Here is a quick tutorial showing you how to set a system up like this. First plug the PLC into the wall and connect it to the computer with a USB cable. This device sends the control codes over the power line to control the lights. Next plug the lamp link device into the outlet and replug the light into the lamp link. We now have to take care of a little bit of software setup. First, let's enable the Insteon plugin inside Girder. Go to Settings and then Plugins to find it. Make sure you also enable the web server in this list. The next step is to link the PLC to the lamp link so that they can talk to each other. This can be easily done from the interface in the following method. Go to the component manager, find the Insteon pages and go to the device manager tab. Click on the start link mode button. You will now see the PLC starting to flash. Go to the lamp link and press and hold the button for 3 seconds until the light flashes. The lamp should now show up on the device manager page. Look at the device ID drop down and find your light. In this case it already exists but you can add it if you need to. Now let's give the lamp a name. The location can be split with backslashes. And that is all there is to it. Now use your iPod or iPhone to navigate to the IP address of the computer that Girder is running on, forward slash iPhone, to access these device manager pages. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, drop by the forums to give your comments or questions, we will be glad to help out.